Play Africa has rolled out active citizenship programs with thousands of children. And again and again, parents and teachers tell us they want to see programs like this in every classroom around the country. So we had an aha moment. What if we took these initiatives and packaged them into a curriculum that could be rolled out in any classroom? And that's how we came up with the My Constitution program. My Constitution is a free toolkit of curriculum resources and materials that aims to empower children with greater awareness of South Africa's constitution, their rights as children, and how to participate in a thriving democracy. A democratic citizen is one who knows what's important to them and to their community. And by being an engaged citizen who knows what their rights are, who they can go to to demand their rights, that gives them the mechanisms to address the issues that are most important to their community. The breadth of these kind of initiatives that Play Africa is involved with and with the Government of Canada's support has such an important focus on the rights of children. And that's an incredible strength of Play Africa. The Constitution, when it is made accessible to children, our future generation, it is something that is massive. And when it happens in the classroom, that's the place where it should be. It is something that must be shared in all our mother tongues so that our children find that the teachers and their parents and, the, and people in the ECD space are, are able to decode it in children's language. The curriculum education on the Constitution is long overdue. When you go for law school, if you do choose that path or career path, you get introduced to learning the Constitution at university. Constitution Hill is a human rights precinct. It came about as a home for the new Constitutional Court of South Africa. So what does Play Africa do for us is that their human rights program synergizes perfectly well with what we are trying to do, educating people on human rights. They take this complex uh, human rights concept and they simplify it for that uh, age group. And this is a place now, Constitution Hill, because of Play Africa presence, where families can come and visit the museum together. The reason the My Constitution program is so powerful is because it's rolling out countrywide to all children and so it expands the reach beyond those that can come and visit Constitution Hill. We want everyone in this country who's an educator of children in grades 3 through 6 to know that they have easy to adapt resources at hand that they can freely put into use today using everyday materials in their own classroom. Play Africa is proud to be based at Constitution Hill, which is right next door to Hillbrow, which is a dense urban area that is home to 40,000 children in one square kilometer. For the 25th anniversary of the Constitution, we invited many of these children to come together to help co-design a mural about children's rights from their own perspective. Our ambition is to see hundreds of thousands of children empowered every year through our My Constitution program and curriculum resources, and together, through our original programs and exhibits, we're trying to disrupt ongoing legacies of inequality and unequal access to rights. And we hope that we are building a future of creativity and innovation, as well as of equality and freedom and dignity. I painted at school, showing kids going at school that they have rights to go to school, they have the right to play at school. I learned that I, as a kid, I have a right to education and freedom and people should also not take advantage of us because I'm a child, they can maybe think of abusing me. Many of those images they came up with, you know, in any case, a feeling of, you know, we, we want to be happy wherever we are. So that goes hand in hand with the Constitution and the Bill of Rights as well. Anyone who's going past can see that it's a child's mural and will think about these are children who've thought about their rights, these are the rights of the child, and we be reminded that children have the same rights in society, in fact, more rights towards protection. In South Africa, we have a globally acclaimed constitution, and on paper, it is extraordinary. But on the ground, we know that children's rights are routinely violated. This child abuse is all over the country, from their own biological parents, from their relatives, from their neighbors, from their teachers. It should not be. So girls' rights, children's rights, boys and girls, must be our priority. A nation that does not honor and love its children cannot be a, a nation that will prosper. Democracy only works when people understand what it is and why it's so important. 
In South Africa, children today don't remember the struggle for democracy or the signing of the Constitution, which is why our work is so important. We're making the Constitution and what it means come alive for a new generation. And we do that through play, by teaching children the foundational values of the Constitution, equality, freedom, and human dignity. And this is critical because it will help children to better exercise their rights and responsibilities as active citizens in a democratic society.